who's have been on the panel after this break. Yeah, thanks very much uh, for that, Stephen. Uh, we have, in fact, we're going straight to me, not the uh, not the break. Yeah, you'd be a big ticky, did you? Uh, as you can see, uh, John's had enough. He's gone back to his hotel room to watch his box out of Mannix. Uh, but I'm delighted to be joined uh, as a last-minute replacement, uh, Eamon. Eamon, are you enjoying it? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Yes, I am. I think it's uh, it's a feast. It's a joyous occasion, and. Uh, I'm really having a good time. It's booked the trend of the World Cup, I think you have to say. Yeah. You see, this World Cup has been characterised by bad play, uh, a joyless, uh, bullying uh, FIFA, uh, and uh, the relentless drive yeah. of uh, venal greed and consumerism. That said, Bill, can I interest you in some pizza? Ha ha ha! All right. Don't uh, stuff the bookies. Stuff your face with this pizza. Yeah. Thanks for Win vouchers for the Aviva Stadium. Yeah. What's okay. that? Okay. A nightclub. Yeah, thanks very much. I think Game has lost the plot. Right, uh, we'll uh, be right back after this commercial break. Don't go away. What the hell is he up to? Not everybody's going to agree with my analysis of the match. Yeah. I wouldn't expect it. To... Yeah, welcome back. So it's uh, one all at half time between uh, Uruguay and Germany in Port Elizabeth. Uh, Liam, can I ask you what did you make of the uh, the first half? Well, I thought the most interesting point was when we lost the commentary bill. Yeah. I wish we'd lost the pictures as well. Yeah. You know, I don't believe we lost the commentary. I think Stephen Alkin headed off to the shops to get a nice burger. But at least we got a, we got a goal in it. And we have a look at the goal here. It was a cracker. Yeah, the first uh, goal. It's coming up now. The ball comes out to Janssen. And he says, you don't expect this back reversal to Schweinsteiger. It goes back to Schweinsteiger. He's got all day. Take out a blanket, cup of tea. Bang! He hits it. Hits the goal. He drops the Muller 1-0. Now, that's easily prevented if you hold it there. I'm going to kick it in this direction because that's where the goal is, Bill. Don't drop the ball into the Pokemon-shaped area or you're going to be 1-0 down. What happens? Bang! Pokemon-shaped area, 1-0 down. Muller hands up. Happy days, Germany. Well, when I say happy days, depends how happy you're going to be winning a crap game like this, Bill. Yeah. Or he took it, he took it away well, though, didn't he? And, and, and Uruguay got into it then, uh, didn't they? They came more into yeah. it. No, I'm no expert, but that's yeah. what it looked like to me. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, no. See, Schweinsteiger here, much covered player in Europe. He, he loses the ball. That's stupid. Now, now they're, they're the, guy, the guy's making a the run there. The guy's making a run. Now, look at the defender. He's marking space. He's marking space. Bang. Goal. Marking goal. That's 1-1. One, one. Now, see, if you where, do where it, if you, you lose... Learn, uh, where did you learn that? John, see, if you lose that, then you got... You've got the opposition, you can move that way. Look. Yeah. There it goes. The guy, see, the guy's marking space guy, the guy in the middle. And he comes in and he scores, he scores that goal. Right. Yeah. That, is, that is rubbish. It's, it's disappointing. You don't expect that at, that at this level, but that's what you're punished. That's what happens if you do that at this level. Bill. Yeah. Yeah. All right. And then, of course, there was another chance there, uh, wasn't there? By, uh... Well, Friedrich had, had an opportunity for a, a header, Bill. Friedrich, it comes from yeah. the corner. He's a big fella, gets his head on it, hits the crossbar. Uh, he went 77 games without scoring a goal, Bill. Scored on a 78, went under the crossbar that had just bounced off there, though not necessarily the same one, says you, Bill, for the crack. Yeah. But anyway, he went 77 games without scoring. He scored on a 78, and we were hoping he was going to score again on the 79th, so he didn't, Yeah. As Stephen Alkin so helpfully informed us, Bill. But yeah. hopefully he'll score again next year. That was Stephen's most interesting comment, I felt, in the first half, did you? No, I, I, I loved a lot of what, I love what, a lot of what Stephen said. And yeah. uh, he said it the other day about the Dutch guy, Schneider. He's got away, he said, I love Schneider. it. Yeah, yeah, he goes, the ball goes in the back of the net, he goes, Schneider! Yeah. I can't wait for it, I can't wait for it. Yeah. Schneider! So a Schweinsteiger Schneider. scores, presumably he'll say, Schweinsteiger! Or Will Schweinsteiger, he? Schweinsteiger. You don't know what he'll do, Stephen. Yeah, he's, he's really unpredictable. He's he is totally he unpredictable. You don't know. You don't know what he's got to do. That's yeah. why. He's unpredictable. Guy. Maybe that's why he has no co-commentator, because he's just so unpredictable. He's, pro he's probably not there at all. He probably legged it down to the shops and he's phoned it in on his fancy phone as he's driving the Jeep towards the beach in Port Elizabethville. <laughs> What's your point, Liam? My point is like the one I just said, that you probably should have heard. Yeah. All right. Eamon Suarez as well, by the yeah, way. Yeah, sure. That Suarez hey, plays hey. for Uruguay, doesn't he? Yeah, he does. Yeah. Now, see, that's Suarez. The full hand. There's Suarez. He gets the ball now. This guy's a £30 million rated player. Right? Now, he can do a number of... Yeah, there it goes. He was banned uh, by uh, FIFA, and he's going to be banned by Uruguay for that. That's rubbish. That's yeah. Felix Park stuff. It's nonsense. Uh, by the post. And yeah. that's why Manchester United and anybody else who's connected with him would be wrong. To okay. pay that kind of money for, for this guy. Yeah. All for right. Suarez. All right. That's enough out of you, Eamon. That's uh, that's all we've got time for for the time being. We'll be right back after this commercial break. Don't go away. Yeah. I bet you won't. You would a bit of pizza, Eamon. Yeah. Yeah. Good night. 
All right, welcome back. Well, of course, uh, it's Uruguay 1, Germany 1. And, of course, if that happens in the second half, it'll be 2 all, won't it? Well, it, yes. In, in not necessarily in the same order, Bill, but yeah. it's quite possible. That's but I don't, I don't, as I said at the beginning of the game, Bill, I don't think it's going to happen that way. I yeah. think it's going to be one all at half time, and then the Germans will want to, to sneak victory in the second half, which I predicted before the game. Yeah. All right. Uh, Eamon, how do you see the second half going? Well, a lot depends on the ball. You know, the ball, it spins through the air. You know, it's a bit ACDC. It goes both ways. You know, it goes this or that way. Wobbles in the air. You don't know what's going to happen. It's, it, it's, you know, the goalkeepers haven't been able to deal with this in the World Cup. Yeah. Uh, uh, so we don't know. But uh, depending on which way the ball goes, I would say uh, Uruguay. Yeah. All right. Well, you might have noticed, uh, folks, that Stephen got very excited uh, during the first half, as he has indeed uh, done throughout the, uh, the whole tournament. But this is how uh, Camacho, the, the Spanish commentator, ex-player and coach, celebrated their goal against Paraguay. Have a look at this. Iniesta, Iniesta, Vamos! Iniesta, para Pedrito, Pedrito puede marcar. Villa, Villa, Villa. Look at how long it's going. Oh my God, it's lucky they won, isn't it, huh? Yeah, they say, they say John Giles repeats himself. Oh, look at that guy. Go, 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 go. You know, yeah. he said it 258,000 times. It's impressive. Yeah, yeah. Huh? What do you think, Liam? I, I saw, you saw Stephen Elkin running past there in the way to get his iceberg, Bill. Can't blame him. Do you think, no, the, uh, are they taking this match seriously? Would you, would you expect there to be any changes now in the second half? I think the, the Germans will certainly make a couple of changes, Bill, because the, the, the side that played the first half were crap. Yeah. So I'd imagine they'd probably put out, even if Lamb is sick, I'd stick him on, uh, stick him on the pitch. Oh, I'm no expert now, as you know. But would you say that Miroslav Klosa will make an appearance now in the second half, huh? Live. Bill, would you just be very careful with your hands there? You hypnotise me and I think I'm a chicken for just a minute or two. Just give me a second to come back. Yeah. Just be careful with that thing. Sorry about that. Eamon, what's yeah. going on inside that skull, huh? <laughs> well, my skull? Yeah. <laughs> oh, no, I'm inside my skull uh, yeah. this, today. Yeah. No, I, uh, I believe that uh, the game is, is a beautiful game. Yeah. It's a joyful occasion. I'm really, yeah. I'm really having a good time. I'm All loving right. this All right. I love it. Yeah, we I know that. It. All right, I love that it. Before. OK, we'll hand you back now to Stephen Alkin.